In this tutorial, we are going to look at advertising. In Kukadu, we have three types of advertising. We have post ads, which appear within the newsfeed alongside your content. We have sidebar ads, which appear on the right side of the screen when you are in any of the screens on Kukadu. In Kukadu Search, we have text ads, which appear down the right side beside the search results. In this example, we're going to create a post ad. A post ad appears alongside content in the news feed, and it also generates income for the content creator of the post that it's attached to. You can see that there are a number of fields that need to be completed. There is a space to upload an image, and you can set how long you'd like the campaign to run for. Let's work through this right now. And this line here is where the headline is typed. Because my advertisement is going to be for a piece of jewelry, an elephant pendant, I'm going to base my ad around this. So the headline of my ad is going to be beautiful enamel elephant pendant. You can see it's populating over here as I type. So you can always see what your ad is looking like as you go. In the description one and description two lines, you can include 50 characters, including spaces. So I'm going to type my description in here in the first line. Elephant I'm going to grab the destination URL, which is on the page where this pendant is being sold on eBay. Click over there. I'm going to grab the URL from the top of the page. I'm going to come back to my tab. I'm going to paste it in here. Now, the keywords for this ad are not necessarily going to be keywords that I have used in my text here or in my description. I'm going to use keywords that you might find in a post uh, that I would like my ad to attach to. So I'm going to choose, first of all, elephant, elephants, plural, necklace, Jewelry, wildlife, and rescue. I'm going to allow a budget of $5 for my ad. I'm going to make a poll. The poll question is going to be, have you ever seen a real elephant? the optional answer yes or no. So you can see that my uh, poll has populated here with the answers yes or no and the buttons. My text is all here, it all makes sense, it's easy to read. Now I just need to select an image file. There we go, there's my file. Click open, it's going to put the elephant picture into the post there. I'm going to choose the number of days I would like my ad to run for. I'm going to max it out at seven days. It's going to check everything that I have written in here. Beautiful enamel elephant pendant. Elephant lovers will adore this pretty pendant. So cute with jewel toned enamel and sparkle. I have my link, which is where people are going to be taken to when they click on my ad. And I've chosen some appropriate keywords. I've put in my budget and I've completed my poll. So I'm ready. I'm happy with what I've got here. I'm ready to click run my campaign. 
it tells me my campaign has been created and I can check this now and it's launched. I can check this now, it's taken me to my post campaigns page. I can see that my post is here. My This little green arrowhead here indicates that the campaign is running. There's the campaign reference. It tells me how much budget I have remaining still and because it's new I've not yet had any views or clicks at this point. Now I can come back in here at any time and I can look at these statistics and know how my ad is performing. I can find this page by going to Dashboard and clicking on Campaigns. 